Hey everyone, welcome back to Swordbox. Today's verse is found in 1 Thessalonians 5, verse 18. Be thankful in all circumstances, for this is God's will for you who belong to Christ Jesus. Um, I first heard this verse when I was young. I was probably about 12 years old, and I was laying in a hospital bed, and I had just broken my hip and come out of surgery for my hip, and I was scared, and I remember my mom sitting next to my bed, and she said, Karen, have you um, thanked God for this? And I remember laughing. And she said, no, I'm, I'm serious. Scripture tells us. And that's the first time I ever heard this scripture that we're supposed to be thankful in all circumstances. And, and it does say all. It doesn't say be thankful for the good things only. It says be thankful in all circumstances for this is God's will for you who belong to Christ Jesus. Um, and I've really kind of struggled on and off with this verse in my life, but I, now that I'm a little older and, and I can really sit back and look at, at the situations and the circumstances, I really find myself looking for Christ in circumstances now, um, and I thank Him for the, the circumstances no matter what. And it takes a lot, it really does, and, and I'm not saying that I'm perfect at it because I'm not, but. Um, two weeks ago today my aunt passed away and and she's home with Jesus now and, and I'm happy she's at peace and um, but in that circumstance I watched God take a relationship between a sister and a brother who had not spoken in 30 years and I watched God heal that relationship it, even in the middle of something bad I miss my aunt terribly and I hated watching her suffer and I hated watching her sickness, but I'm so thankful for the situation because it brought my mom and my uncle back together after 30 years. Um, a week ago, there was a drive-by shooting at our house, and I can tell you that as I look at that situation, as bad as it is, um, and as horrifying as it was for my 11 year old to watch as a gun came out of a car shooting at his friends, um, I know that God had his hand on that situation because he not only protected my son, he protected all of the people that were out in the street, but my 17 year old son should have been out there with all of those kids and he wasn't. My five year old daughter should have been running where they were shooting and she wasn't. God protected my children. I can see that even in a bad situation like that, I'm thankful. Tonight I just left the ER um, with my oldest son. He, he broke his hand and I'm thankful for that because it gave us an opportunity to sit and talk about just where he's at with his relationship with Jesus because his temper got the best of him and his anger got the best of him and instead of turning and handing it over to Christ he allowed that anger and that temper to go and and he he broke his hand because he was punching the punching bag without a glove on um, but I'm still thankful because I know that God can use any circumstance Romans 8 28 says and we know that God causes everything to work together for the good of those who love God and are called according to his purpose for them. God works everything out, even the bad circumstances, even things that aren't necessarily seen as good. I encourage you in all circumstances to be thankful to God. I encourage you to hand it over and I encourage you to even look for God in every circumstance. Um, it becomes interesting. When you're, when you're sitting in the middle of things and you're like, okay, God, I know you're going to work together for good, but, but what's it going to be? And you start to look and your focus becomes on what God's doing instead of the bad junk that's around you. And it helps you get through. I encourage you to turn all your circumstances over to Christ and be thankful. Um, thanks again for coming back to Swordbox, and we will talk with you tomorrow.